Hello everybody. Uh, today I am going to be taking a look at this Samsung Chromebook which is um, owned by a friend of mine. Now he sat on it um, again. Uh, he's the guy that sat on the Nintendo Switch and brought the Joy-Cons so he should really stop sitting on things but um, it gives me something to to do which is nice. So this, like I say, Samsung Chromebook and since he sat on it, he said that the display is funny, which it is. You can see it there. So we've got some blue lines down the side, across the top, and then we've just got some horizontal lines going all the way through it. Um, it's a bit loose there. Um, I wonder if it would work... Has it got HDMI? Yeah, so it's got a HDMI out, which... I should be able to connect up to the TV and see if it is a problem with the display or if it's, you know, a problem with the actual Chromebook itself. And there we go, it's come up on the, on the TV, no problem. So it's definitely a problem with the display on the Chromebook. So, I think I'm going to have to take it apart and see what's going on. going on here then. Hmm. I'm thinking this is the the display. It's got a cable that runs that runs up here. And it looks like it goes through this hinge here. That was actually loose. Right, so that definitely is the display, because when I just did that, the screen went off. So I'm just going to try putting some pressure on this, just to see if that... No. I mean, just looking at the display, there's no obvious signs of any cracks or any, any damage which is what's leading me to believe that it might just be the cable. So how do I get to these, to the hinges? In just temporarily. I 
There we go, he's working. So what have I, <laughs> what I haven't done anything? Um, so there was obviously something trapped in that um, in the hinge. But all I've really done is, yeah, I've not really done much, but it's now working fine. Well, I guess I've just freed it up by by opening this up. Um, all I can think of is that it was trapped inside here. Well, let's, I'm going to try and put it back together. I'm going to see if it's still working when I put it back together. Is it is possible that it is just the fascias pressing on it somewhere where it, it doesn't like it, but I can't seem to be able to replicate it now, which which is odd. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to try and put it back together. This could end up being another <laughs> very simple fix. Okay, here we have it fully back together. See if it works now. Yes, it does. Right, well, <laughs> job done. That was um, incredibly easy, that one. So, I, I, like I said before, I think it must have just been um, must have just been a snagged cable or something. You know, when he's sat on it, he's obviously put something out of place. But for me, it just really underlines the importance of, of opening something up to, to see what's wrong with it, because I, I literally didn't have to do anything, really. I just moved a couple of wires around, um, whereas a lot of people would probably have sent this in for repair, and it would have cost an arm and a leg. Um, so uh, apologies. It's, again, it's, it's not a particularly exciting video. I didn't really have to do anything. I didn't get my soldier iron out. I didn't have to do anything other than use my screwdriver really um, but you know it's it's now working so um, job done so that's that's about it for the video thanks very much for watching if you enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe for more can I fix it and how-to videos thank you cheery bye-byes <laughs>